So hi guys, this is Rodrigo from DJ Tech Zone. So we are here with Ben uh, from uh, Denon DJ and we are going to run uh, through some of the updates uh, done to the SC5000, the X1800 uh, uh, mixer and of course uh, the Engine Prime software. And Ben is going to take us through it and uh, give us the explanation. What's up DJ Tech Zone? Ben here with Denon DJ. Excited to show you the updates for the Denon Prime series, SC5000 Prime Media Player and X1800 Prime Mixer. It's been a fantastic year for Denon DJ. We've been in clubs, in, on festival stages all over the world. The reaction has been fantastic. We've had a great year and we're very excited to show the new updates to the Prime series here today at NAMM 2018. So, our standalone media player is now able to be a fully featured Serato controller. So with our version 1.0.2 update, we're actually now on 1.0.3, we have added full Serato control in controller mode. So the DJ will now press source, tap the computer icon, and the SC5000 will restart into controller mode. So your X1800 becomes your Serato sound card, the Serato uh, fully featured Serato mixer and DVS upgrade ready X1800 is now your full sound card for Serato. You send out to your computer via USB, connect your SC5000s together in HID mode and you've got the full Serato control experience right on the SC5000. So you're able to navigate and browse on the touch screen through your files and folders and sub crates. Serato's SP8 and cues and loops and slices are all now possible uh, for control right here on the multifunction performance pads. So it really creates a new and expanded Serato experience for the user with this most current update. Also 1.0.3 now brings record box support for the DJ via thumb drive or SD card so the, the DJ can plug in and the record box crates and files and folders and cue points and loops will now come over to the prime environment. So we're giving the DJs more ways to use the SC5000 breaking down that barrier to entry as well. So the X1800 version 1.1.1 update adds a couple of new effects to the list, including Hall Echo, Bit Crush, and a reverb with a freezable tail that's also adjustable as well. So giving you more ways to customize your DJ performance. Of course, you can add the BPM effects to the high pass and low pass filter section and combine those as well with our four sweep effects on board. So giving you more ways again to customize the sound of your performance and the Prime series here is really continuing to push the envelope and revolutionize DJing for the future. Great. Okay. Thank you very much.